Hey guys, Chris here with another amazing vehicle that we're going to be auctioning off on carsandbids.com. So this is a 2021 Mercedes-Benz GLE 450. This one has the six cylinder and uh, it is absolutely stunning vehicle. 44,000 miles. I've owned this vehicle since new and have absolutely loved it. Drives really well. So in terms of... Uh, features this one's got the exterior lighting package these lights are uh, are really nice and uh, when you turn the car on they do this like light dance it's really uh, it's really nice uh, the high automatic high beam obviously and they even have these little sensors lights on the door so at night when you open the door I'll try to make another video on that it has the Mercedes logo on the floor and it just looks really nice so this one is sitting on uh, Michelin tires and one thing about this car is that the back tires are so thick and are wide I guess you should say look at that that is a wide tire so they're Michelin's and what that does it just gives you a lot of stability they're just very stable see if I can find the tire size privacy tour 275 45 21 so 275 on 21 inch rim this one does have the uh, towing package which I only used once the towing package to tow a jet ski. And then I realized owning a jet ski was a little bit more work than I thought when you only use it once every year or so. So sold the jet ski and that was the last time I towed anything with this Mercedes. So um, this particular Mercedes, I actually, I, no, did I build it? No, I didn't build it, but um, it was, it had pretty much everything that I wanted on it. That's why I got it. Cause it had, this one has the AMG exterior package. So you get this like front grill, which is gorgeous with these stars, huge Mercedes logo. Um, I wanted the lighty package that really liked the upgraded lights. It also has the AMG uh, wheels with the AMG logos right there. Really like the uh, 21 inch rib on this. I think it looks fantastic. And then I also got this one also had the AMG uh, interior package as well. So you get these like half suede, half leather sport seats, which are really nice quality what you'd expect from mercedes and then you also have the amg steering wheel amg floor mats on the back amg floor mats and uh just really nice the, the suede and the leather combination on these is really nice push to start and one of the things so and it and the, during the day it's hard to tell I, mean, I should probably do this video at night but the lighting in this car is absolutely ridiculous and one of the things that sold me on this was the dash the dash there's not many vehicles that have a more beautiful dash than this mercedes i really like the way the dash looks it's just really beautiful and same with the inside the wood trim so there's a light that goes across here. You can see it during the day, but it's really at night is when it really gets impressive. So right now, my wife's been driving it, as you can see with the flowers. She has it set to pink. You could change the uh, the color. Uh, you could even, I think you could do it where it'll change colors. But um, you can set your color 
and what's cool too like when you're setting your temperature so i'm raising the temperature now it turns to red if i'm lowering the temperature it turns to blue when you go down 60 as low as you can go now it goes to white you can't go down any further if i want to raise the temperature so stuff like that um you have two lightning usb ports right there which you can charge your phone the navigation um, on this car is pretty impressive. You can control everything with this pad right here, and it is very easy to use. It's also touch screen. So you can zoom in, zoom out. Uh, you can speak to the car. It has, hey, Mercedes. So you can tell it where you want to go or um, ask for directions. <clears throat> and then also with these gauges, you can adjust everything. So I can put a clock here the miles got 44,000 miles and that's the reason why I'm uh, selling it is because I bought it was a lease I bought it brand new I get 60,000 miles for your lease I'm already at 44 within the first two years so I don't want to go over the miles so I'd like to sell it while it's still under factory warranty to the next owner Here you got a uh, formatic shows you your four x four or your all wheel drive distribution, all sorts of stuff that you can, you can put the navigation there. And then here we've got, uh, let's see, XM radio volume control right here. The sound system on this is really good. Burmaster, it's a fantastic sound system. So it has an XM radio. I think I paid for that for the year. I'm not sure when it expires, but it's active right now. Settings. So um, let's see what else. There's a lot of stuff you can do. Oh, like for driving settings. So I can do sport mode, comfort mode, economy mode. And by the way, this car is actually really good on gas. Um, 400 miles, I mean, I think it's like almost 600 miles when you fill it up. And even have off-road mode. So we normally do comfort mode or, or sport. And SOS buttons up here, um, sunglasses. You also have, this one also comes with the panoramic. Uh, sunroof. Uh, what else? What else does it have? Um, oh, it has so the three D parking. Uh, it also has self parking. Which it's funny, I ne almost never use it. I should because it's pretty impressive, but uh, it'll parallel park for you. Um, and let's see how do you do it? I used it in a while. Parking assist. Oh, here we go. Well, <laughs> I've forgotten how to use it, but uh, it will um, parallel park for you. It's got to see the, that there's a space open, and then it'll automatically park. It's funny, I used that like the first day I got it, and... Uh, and then I forgot about it and I never used it again. Oh my gosh. I guess sometimes it's easier to just park yourself. But it is there if you need it. Or I guess if you're going to park in like a really tight spot.
This car uh, drives great. There's really no issues. Um, other than there's a little bit of road, uh, what is it called, curb rash on one of the wheels. And that's it. There's no scratches hardly on the entire car. It drives great, no issues. It's 2021, uh, still under warranty. And uh, really, uh, really enjoyed using this car for the past few years. I think the next owner will too, so. Okay guys, well thanks for watching. Let me know uh, what questions you have in the comments.